Jenny Ackerman, husband, father, golfer, friend, from Whitbank, as a guy who started playing golf there, played on the Sunshine Tour. After the Sunshine Tour, went into business, looked after people everywhere in the world, always gave back, never had a bad word to say about anybody. One thing Yanni never did was say no. He couldn't say no. We miss you, Yanni. What you did for Golf South Africa and for people in need will never be forgotten. Rest in peace, my friend. Yeah, the IGT Tour is a, it's a great development tool for us. It's a chance for you know aspiring golfers to come out and play every week. Um, the schedule is pretty full as well. So I mean, yeah, just getting the reps in, uh, the ability to test yourself against your peers at every level. It's it's a stepping stone tour to to great things. Hole number one is quite a short puffle, um, quite a wide fairway. I do normally hit driver there. Uh, anything just to, um, up the right hand side of the fairway. So, and then you've got a, quite an easy approach shot in. Here we are today at Services Golf Club for IGT number 17. Final round and the final pairing. All the players playing their last respects to Mr. Yanni Ackerman, who unfortunately passed away earlier in the week. Stefan, where's Taylor? Getting his round off. Very happy with that one. Matt Suarez currently in second place, one shot behind the leader. Also hoping for a nice fast and steady start to his round. Oh, when they pick the peg up that quickly, invariably they're very happy with that. An overnight leader. Tournament leader Andrew von Knapp, currently minus eight, was hoping for a solid start to his final round. First time being a leader of a professional golf tour in the final round. Fuji seems to have hung on to that a little bit, looking a bit worried. And it was with due cause had to take a drop out of the penalty area and struggling to find the green with his third shot, leaving him a top tough fourth. Stefan coming from the perfect angle to the stuck flag. Left himself a couple of feet for a birdie on hole number one. Matt after quite a long drive. Not too much trouble in front of him. Should be able to get this one out close. Unfortunately for him that one checking a bit but he'll have an uphill birdie putt. Andrew's bow is not finished yet, has to keep it low. Fortunately, a little bit strong, leave him a tough swinger to try and make his bogey. Selected to take the putter. He's given it a chance. It's around a couple of feet. A little bit of meat left on that bone. Matt, hoping to capitalize on the situation with his birdie putt. Fortunately, not reading that one too well, but he'll clean up nicely for a par. Solid start to his round. Stefan now with an opportunity to pull one back on the leaders. Right to left, but fortunately, that one just turning and catching the bottom edge of the hole. But he'll clean up nicely there. Tap in for par. Also a good start to his round. Andrew with a tasty little three footer. Fortunate for a double bogey, but he'll want to roll this in to give him a bit of confidence for the rest of the round, which it duly does. Unfortunate start. <laughs> 